part by Inked Playmats at inkplaymats.com. Your place for custom-made playmats. Design your own or shop from other featured designers. Use promo code CLOTS to save 10% on your order. Inked Playmats. Your game, your style. To do on their website and come join us for a fun-friendly F&M environment. Hello everybody, this is Kevin from Klotz Productions, and welcome back to game two of the match between Wolf Run Green and Blue White Humans. Trevor was on the play for this game, and started off by laying down a sea chrome coast and using it to cast a Doom Traveler. Tower then laid down a forest and passed his turn, and Trevor laid down a plains and resolved in honor of the pure, he then attacked with his Traveler, dropping Tyler to 18. Tower then laid down a Kessig Wolf Run and put a Ratchet Bomb into play. Trevor attacked again, dropping Tyler to 16, then at the end of the turn, Tyler added a counter to his Ratchet Bomb. On his turn, he resolved a Birds of Paradise, and Trevor laid down a Mullen Haunt and used an Oblivion Ring to get rid of the Ratchet Bomb. He then attacked again, dropping Tyler to 14. Then post-combat, he played a Champion of the Parish. Tyler put a Dungrove Elder into play, and then Trevor put an Angelic Destiny on his Doomed Traveler and attacked with the Traveler along with the Champion. Tyler took the 8 damage, going down to 6. Then for his turn, he cast a Land of War Elves, and then followed it up by using a Green Sun Zenith for 1 to find a second bird. Trevor used a Fiend Hunter to exile the bird and pump his champion. He then attacked with the champion and the Traveler again. Tyler Chump blocked the Traveler with his other bird and then took the damage from the champion going down to 3. Tower didn't play anything on his next turn and then Trevor attacked with his team. Tower used a Naturalize to destroy the Angelic Destiny. He then blocked the Traveler with his Elder and the champion with his Elves. They all died except for the champion but Trevor got a Spirit Token into play. Then Tyler took 2 from the Hunter going down to 1. Then at the end of his turn he put a Glacial Fortress into play before passing. Tyler drew his next card and then went ahead and scooped, giving Trevor the win and taking them to game three. So that's it for this game, I hope you all enjoyed it. You can find the full version and the annotations at the end of the video, along with links to previous highlights gameplays. And as always, if you like this or any other video, give it a thumbs up and add it to your favorites, and then subscribe to be notified when more videos are online.